Today we will be showing you a backlight replacement on an Allen Bradley Panel View 550. The problem that we had with this screen is that when we apply power, we are getting no illumination of the backlight at all. So the screen appears blank. And we will go ahead and turn up our voltage. You can barely see a cursor flickering. This indicates that the LCD might be good, it just has no backlight. So we are going to go ahead and power off and then take a look. So this plate is for the lamp. And we have the lamp assembly here. So the lamp assembly will be bright enough to illuminate these fiber optic strands. You can see the strands. This is a fiber optic style backlight, and that will be the backlight for the LCD. Now, the first thing that we are going to check with the backlight is if we have good voltage coming to the actual component, because it could be that there is no voltage here. So, we are going to test for that. We will power the device back on, and for our access point, we will use these pins here and measure our DC voltage. It should be around 5 volts. And there you have it. We have a good 5 volt voltage here. So we know that the problem must be in this backlight. However, we are going to put a modern backlight in this device. Here you can see that this is an old bulb version and they are prone to failure and a short life expectancy. So we are going to remove this and install a more modern LED style bulb and it has an electrical assembly here for current purposes. So we will go ahead and install. We will turn off the power, install our new backlight, making sure that it is aligned correctly with the glass. Now the lamp and the fiber optic is lined up. We will go ahead and put the cover back on and we will see what our display looks like up front. So you can see now we have a nice bright display and we can continue testing this unit, cleaning it and getting it ready to ship to the customer. Thank you for watching. For more videos, subscribe to our channel.